Let's determine the sum of 3 and 7. I want to count on to find the sum, but I don't want to count on 7 because that's going to take me a long time. I'm going to use the commutative property of addition to change the order of the addends and rewrite 3 plus 7 as 7 plus 3. That means I have 7 and then I just count on 3. 7, 8, 9, 10. 7 plus 3 is 10 and that means 3 plus 7 is 10. Let's determine the difference of 12 minus 8 by building up through 10. We're going to write 12 minus 8 equals an unknown number as 8 plus an unknown number equals 12. That means I will get to 10 and then count on until I get to 12. First, I will represent 8 on a 10 frame. That's 5. Now we have 8. Then I will build to 10. 9, 10. That was 2. Next I will count on until I get to 12. 11, 12. That's 2. 2 and 2 is 4. That means 8 plus 4 is 12. 12 minus 8 is 4. Let's determine the difference of 12 minus 8 by building down through 10. That means subtracting to get to 10 and then subtracting until I get to 8. First, I will represent 12 on a double 10 frame. When a 10 frame is full, that's 10. So I will build this 10 frame up. And then 11, 12. Then I will take away two counters because I need to get to 10. This is 12, I only need 10. Here's one, here's two. Now I have 10, and if I take two away, I have eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Two and two is four, and that means 12 minus eight equals four. 